Sussex by the sea, always an inviting prospect. Welcome everyone to the Amex Stadium. My name is Derek Ray, excited to be bringing you match commentary. And alongside me, my broadcasting partner, Stuart Robson. And very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It's Brighton up against West Ham United. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. And the team selected for Brighton and Hove Albion. Well, it's a defensive looking lineup, but if the wing backs break forward, the midfield can get close to the front pair, and the front two can link up with each other, they should still cause problems today. And the starting lineup for West Ham United. Well, in this shape, their two holding midfield players will be key today. If they can get on the ball and dictate the play, protect the two centre backs, it will then allow the attacking players to show their creative quality. Thank you for attending today's game at the Amex Stadium. Enjoy the match. And the game begins. Pascal Gross. McAllister Well, not the pass he had in mind Possession lost by the Hammers Suchek Lanzini well that is how to run at defenders Rice on to Gross Alexis McAllister Now Caicedo, chance to do damage, but nothing comes of it. Antonio, spot on with that tackle. Using his physical strength to make sure he doesn't lose the ball. Well back take the lead here and they have you've got to say it has been coming well it's a goal you'd expect him to score but he kept his cool and he put it away nicely he'll be happy with that So West Ham get us moving again and a swift response required after the setback. Suchek. Lanzini. Encouraging move from West Ham. Declan Rice. 
And it's with Tomasz Suchek. And he's won the ball. And the keeper in position to grab hold of it. Alexis McAllister. Well, what can they do to stop him running at them? Chance here. Opportunity. And there it is. A two-goal cushion now. And they just need to keep the concentration. Well, here we can see it again. And no wonder the manager is furious. They just have to get tighter here. Deal with the danger. Otherwise, that's the outcome. Not good enough defensively. Second goal for them here. Lanzini. For Niles. Rice with it. Suchek. Attacking possibilities for West Ham. Really good challenge. Well, as you can see, Brighton are controlling the possession and have used it really well today, particularly in the midfield areas. And I expect more of the same as the game goes on. Well, not quite the cross he was hoping for. Vladimir Kuval. Jared Bowen. Looking confident with the ball at his feet. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Counter-attacking very much an option. He's found a pocket of space. The cross is on. An authoritative challenge. Antonio, ball with Pablo Fornals. And in the perfect position to read it. Now Caicedo, Pascal Gross. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Well, it looked like open road for them, but up a dead end. Aaron Cresswell. Antonio. Well, they keep working away, looking for passing lanes. Pascal Gross. It's with Welbeck. Well back. Not messing around with that clearance. And the fourth official confirming that we'll have one additional minute. Declan Rice. Now the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. And I think it's fair to say he's had happier days in front of goal, Stuart. Well, Derek, he's usually so clever around the edge of the box, but today he just hasn't shown that. As the touch map shows us, he hasn't had enough touches in those key areas. So back underway here, and West Ham left with a real mountain to climb in the second half. Can they respond? Declan Rice. Here's Manuel Lanzini. Patient build-up at the moment. Rice with it. 
for Niles. Lanzini. And dispossessed. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. And showing fine vision. Enoch Mwepu. And that's a corner. Trying to deliver it accurately. Well, as a defender, that will suit you down to the ground. Suchek. Rice with it. Antonio. Well, there to intercept. Lanzini. Chance to reduce the arrears. Oh, we have just witnessed a special moment. Pure quality. Well, let's take another look at this because the turn to beat his marker is absolutely brilliant. He just leaves him for dead and opens up the space for him to finish. What a piece of skill that is. So back on the way, can West Ham find another one? Dunk. Now Caicedo. Well, he was in the right place to intercept. What can the Hammers do from this position? Antonio. What an astonishing few minutes from seemingly out of it. It's all square again. Can you believe it? Well, here's the goal again, and what a wonderfully weighted pass this is. And his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. So back underway, dead level, 2-2. 30 minutes to go then. Trossard, Mwepu, Caicedo, and there to intervene. Antonio, here's Manuel Lanzini, Jared Bowen. Rice, well read to put an end to that attack. Well, he likes to run at them. McAllister. Pascal Gross. Well back. Can he finish? It has to be, surely. Well, the keeper performing brilliantly. Well, that's just incredible. He reacted so quickly there. Antonio. Jared Bowen. Promising looking attack from West Ham. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Antonio. And here's Lanzini. Press well. And return to four nows. Could take the lead. It's in. And this really takes your breath away. A comeback and a half.
Well, here it is again. The build-up is so patient. They're just waiting to play that killer pass at the right time. And then the shot is emphatic. He strikes it with such power, the keeper has no time to react. What a good finish. And they're making a change. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Substitution for Brighton and Hove Albion. Coming off the pitch, number 18, Danny Wilder. A quarter of an hour remaining here. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful. Nwepu. Caicedo with it. Mope. Great opportunity. That's a great stop. Well, his reflexes are so good there. That's a fantastic stop. So a personnel change then. Number 20, Jared Bowen. To be replaced by number 7, Andrew Yarmolenko. Taken short. Yarmolenko. Vladimir Kupal and showing fine vision and with that the attack fizzles out well I'm not sure they deserve anything from this game but there's still time to find that equaliser and you have to say the crowd have been brilliant they're still driving the team on well that's how to break the spirit of the attacker They get forward, but time is very much against them here. Trossard, and a tidy challenge. For Niles. In possession, Dawson. Suchek. On the ball, Mikael Antonio. Well, racing past his man. And his teammate got him out of trouble. In possession, Caicedo. Trossard. Trossard. What a shocking pass, really. The electronic board has been held in the air and we're going to have a minimum of four added minutes. Will it happen for them? And back with Trossard. Cleared away comprehensively. Antonio. And they need to get tighter here. Cuts it back. A goal here! Giving his team precisely what they were looking for. Now he deserves to celebrate it. Well, here's the replay. He's done well to get his head up, pick out a teammate, and then it's a pretty tidy finish too. Hits it hard, he hits it low, and it just makes it difficult for the keeper. A really nice goal. West Ham United goal. And there goes the final whistle. I'll tell you what, not the outcome fans of Brighton and Hove Albion had in mind. Well, Derek, I thought it was a subpar performance from them. Just didn't look as sharp as normal. And I don't think they deserved anything from the game. They need to get a better performance in next time out. Well, Pablo Fornals can be a real handful for opponents and certainly was at times today. Stuart, they struggled to contain him.
Well, he should be pleased with himself today because he performed really well. He scored a good goal and they won the game. An excellent day all round. Well back. Must take the lead here. And they have. You've got to say, it has been coming. Chance here. Opportunity. And there it is. A two-goal cushion now. And they just need to keep the concentration. Lanzini. Chance to reduce the arrears. Oh, we have just witnessed a special moment. Pure quality. What an astonishing few minutes. From seemingly out of it, it's all square again. Can you believe it? And return to Fornals. Could take the lead. It's in. And this really takes your breath away. A comeback and a half. Mope. That's a great stop. Well, his reflexes are so good there. That's a fantastic stop. precisely what they were looking for now he deserves to celebrate it